Krista Tegen attacks Donald Trump. Giving birth is more painful than coronavirus tests. So I was trying to look for the tweets from Donald Trump that um, started this, but I don't think it's a tweet. It's probably a, a he video, said, something yeah. he said. <sighs> okay, let me keep my opinion to myself. For now. I don't get it. Given who's, Donald Trump said giving birth is more painful. No, no, no. no. He was talking about, about the how pain. the pain of coronavirus. for being yeah. tested. Um, I don't know the process. I haven't, yeah. you know, I haven't been I've seen a picture, to but I don't know Chris, how true that is. Chrissy like, is saying put, like, giving birth is more painful than yeah. it was. And, and it's not just her. There's another <laughs> lady who actually started it. I think she's a TV host or something. And the conversation what, has the blown out of proportion. And I'm wondering what exactly is your problem? Exactly. I think, I, think, I, mean, I think Americans are mad at Donald Trump. Trump and yeah. they have every right to be. He's done a lot of things that are not the most effective way. Oh, and not, no, and not the most conventional. I would like to use yeah, effective. effective. They, I think, they, I think it's not a, used I, to no, it. They're not it's used not, to it. Let's mm, even take this, this coronavirus yeah, issue should, uh, first. It's not, when he shut down America, everybody was attacking Donald Trump. But yeah. right now, it's clear that he saved lives. I mean, that's just an example. When I'm saying un, that, that, that effective. Uneffe uneffect ineffective, I'm talking about him calling it the Chinese virus. I'm talking about him mentioning things that are... Uh, uh, the ash triggering but you know he has physical he has a lose, damage you know he has a to mouth, other people and that's you know. what i'm talking yeah, about yeah, he has, he has that's what i'm talking mouth, about it's i don't think it is talk, i don't think the president should be calling it that um we're already having series of attacks on asian people all over the country oh, you that's something recent i don't know if you saw that so for true. me to say that it's ineffective i think i have a right to say that i think you can talk better than that to get more effective ways of, of organizing although i don't want to trail away because i know if it was africa they wouldn't hesitate to come tonight to come to africa hmm. take pictures of the dead of the uh, black people <laughs> say oh poor children come and save our lives i'm not trying to like make him look like you know he's not he's not doing something that everybody has has, done. has, yeah. has, has done but um then again there is this underlining like anger especially from democrats to donald trump do i really support that not really i think donald trump actions are better than how he talks and to me i'll put my money where the actions are rather than somebody who talks really well and yeah. is pleasing everybody but isn't really doing that much work yeah um but for for tiggy um i call her tiggy she needs to calm down i don't get it um it's not that deep uh, we know you're it's not even close birth. to being deep. You, you, you know you're giving birth. You know we applaud thing. you for that. She's but. talking about giving birth. Some people jumped on it and said talking about um, the test and processes when you're dealing with cancer. And I'm like, wow. Now this is getting really serious. I think what so he, if the, you the, say you've gone you know, through a certain level of pain, someone has come to tell to you another her, level of pain. If I'm going to defend her. I think the problem with the president complaining about the pain of the test is also not encouraging people to go do the test. There's a lot of people who have been quarantined that have been sick. That you see tweets of people saying, my neighbor is sick and it's not coming out. My boyfriend is sick and it's not coming out. Because there's a lot of stigma around that. And you complaining, like, a, I don't use the B word, um, about the pain as a precedent might just, just you know, not encourage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so I, don't, I, 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 I she's coming from that. But I still feel like there's other ways that you can say that rather than comparing that to giving birth. Like... Giving birth is like a natural thing that nobody forced you to do. That's you it, opened man. your legs, you got pregnant, and it's a natural thing that happens. This is something that, this is a virus that we didn't invite. That's not supposed to be sitting among human beings. And we're forced to that type of, um, you know, subjection of, 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 of treatment in trying to get a test whether you're positive or negative. So I feel like we're allowed to say, ouch, like that hurts. You know, like I'm not going to compare you my surgery you're taking an injection. to giving birth either. I mean, we, we come out and say, oh, that yeah. hurts. There are people who still have injection fright still tomorrow. Yeah. So you cannot downplay that because you've gone through childbirth. Yeah, that's I it. Don't, I, 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 I love Chrissy. That's the very interesting part of this whole conversation. Like, I love her. But this time around, I don't know. What I think it's been lately, you. actually, that she's been losing me. There's a lot of yeah, like she, righteous she, she anger. Yeah. I'm just like, whoa, calm down. I, I, Where I, is this I coming feel, from? And again, I feel it's misdirected. I, I want to say maybe it was all, all the emotion, all the emotions that comes mm. up with being pregnant, and probably right now she's going through a lot of emotion and post. Um, post -tra traumatic um, um, PP. No, or maybe she's just worried about the number of people you know, dying and she just a, reacted mm, yeah. that way. But this reaction. Yeah, but is there's, no, there's no ground for comparison. Mm -hmm. And like you rightly said, Donald Trump does not, he defies the typical, you know, aristocratic president of the United States. He's very much unconventional in the way he says things. He's, do I think he has loose, a whole lot of loose talk? Sure, yes, definitely. I think so. For, for a president, some of the things they are not befitting. You know, and so that's why he, I say it defies who the American, the stereotype of who the American president is. But is he getting a whole lot of work done? 
His critics cannot even deny that. Yes, it might it might sometimes seem to them unclear and maybe in the most harshest way, but he's doing stuff. And he is. Yeah, he is really working for the American people. And I wish our governments can actually take you from I that mean, and, and do what they need to do. Give them Buhari you know. and take Trump. I will, though. <laughs> Uh, you know? I will. I mean, he's causing a different problem, but I feel like his prob the the solutions he's giving out to me just is a white supremacist, and they're so they're so. Uh, I don't tend to disagree you know. with that. I feel oh, like he's he done is. a lot for the black community. He says racist things. Oh, wait, when, I, when I keep saying like, if you look at his actions, forget what Trump is say, saying. The I was referring to, he actually came out to advocate for the Asian community yeah. that they've been through a lot, uh, and that we should. Maybe may, 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 may so we'll I'm like, no, no, I have to go and check if maybe he did no, this. Maybe we argue that because a little it's political. The elections are getting close by, and so he needs but to make them feel somehow. Before now, he, let's go back. Let, let's like go back to all of the things he has said. Before taking, now, he sounds like he looks to me like you know, a basket that has. He's a, poli like, he's a politician. He's doing some work. He's shedding he's me with poli his work. I think he's he right puts now. it out as he feels. So yeah, that's it. And so he's getting closer to another election year. He needs them for Christ's sakes. And so but he's he, been doing that since the beginning of time. And I, I don't know. We'll see. Okay, we'll see.